guys, I'm going to show you how to do a nice setup of your a, a nice turn and circle within uh, within Truck Simulator 2. If we crack on into the game, and I'll show you how to set up. I'll also be showing you uh, my setup um, on obviously a picture of what my mouse and that looks like, so it makes it easier for you to know what to go by. Right. If we now crack on to options and then go on to controls, right? You have you have an input wizard, but you don't want to go onto that straight away. If you go up to the top one, you'll see keyboard only, keyboard and mouse steering. Um, this is the one that you want. So you click on that, and you have all this. If you then go onto input wizard, go onto mouse steering, and then choose whatever one you want. Um, obviously, just going for this for a minute. And finish wizard, um, and then when, once you've done that, what's happened here? Right, keyboard and mouse. Yeah. Once you've done that, obviously you have steering sensitivity. Obviously, I've got it in the middle of that because that perfectly suits me as it is. Um, obviously, if you have a sharp hand in, then obviously that'll be the top. If if you don't can't can't turn very well or whatever, um, put it down the bottom. Um, but obviously, just just keep playing around with it to see what makes it what makes it feel best for you. Um, that's all done there for you. And then obviously, with obviously what I was on about a minute ago of uh, all the buttons and stuff like that. If we, I'll show you what left indicator, right indicator buttons, and all stuff like that is. Uh, if we just crack on, go to this one. This is my setup at the minute. Um, obviously, using all this. With the left indicator, I'm actually using this button here, um, and obviously the right button on the other side as well. With, with lights, uh, light modes, if I've put it on that, obviously for dip and then main beam um, to turn on during night, and then high beam, I've clicked as this one. Um, and then with the scroller, I, if you click that in, I've put set that as wipers, um, which I'll show you uh, on the options when we go back into the game in a second. Obviously, with obviously dual carriageway um, transport, you have to obviously you get quite bored of holding holding the forward, don't you? Um, so I set cruise control as my right shift here, um, which makes it a hell of a lot easier. Um, but then, like I said, it's it's up to you how you want to set it up. I'm just helping you guys out to make it feel all right for you. Uh, if you crack and go back to the game again, um, yeah, as I we was saying, left left button on the mouse like far left and then that's far right um, light mode is that right button Le high beam is the left button and then obviously the wipers was the, the middle button like there and then the cruise control is right shift If it's up totally up to you as well I've set myself um, oh, it's obviously not right here I've set myself to look left and look right and use the left and right, left and right arrow keys if um, I can now go into the game and show you exactly what I mean. Let this load up. Oh, I've run out of fuel. Right, I'm now moving my uh, mouse, and as you can see, the steering works. If you know, if you press well, whatever it is to go on to see the outside, you can see the little thing in the middle of the screen at the bottom. Um, moving around, that's me moving my mouse left to right. If I show you, if I start the engine, I'll turn full right and it will turn. Look. This is good. Right. Um, and then I see all that sort of stuff. Obviously, you've got your left indicator, right indicator, and obviously, if you go back into the cab, you got. Obviously, your light switches, and obviously high beam, which is good. Obviously, you can see the indicators in here, um, and now obviously cruise control. I told you what that one was. Um, middle button wipers, um, but like I said, it's totally up to you. And then obviously with those left and right arrow keys that I was telling you about just a minute ago, you can look right, look, and then obviously look left. Um, it's that, but that's totally up to you of how you want to set it up, um, and that's basically it, really, guys. I just hope that helps helps you out a bit of how uh, 
of how you would like to have it set up instead of using the arrow keys all the time. Um, hope this helps and I'll be making more videos soon. Thanks very much.